Hey guys, in this video we're going to talk about the differences between InDesign and Adobe Illustrator and Adobe Photoshop. So InDesign is uh, the uh, desktop publishing tool that uh, you will use uh, for creating uh, um, the uh, flow of the project. So for example, uh, if you were to create uh, a magazine, um, I would use uh, the um, InDesign as the basic of the, um, of the document. And um, instead I would use Illustrator to create uh, illustrations and uh, other type of uh, vector graphics. And um, I can also update them, I can uh, edit them and really do all the vector graphics work in Illustrator. While I would use Photoshop for uh, the raster graphics and that uh, includes uh, phot photos. So I'll, um, if you were to modify photos or create uh, photo manipulations, um, I would highly suggest using Photoshop or even if you have to improve uh, the brightness, contrast, um, saturation, those kind of uh, things, uh, um, you, you'd want to use either Photoshop or Lightroom if uh, you have a lot of photos. And um, after that, uh, um, you will bring the vector illustrations or assets from uh, Illustrator to InDesign and uh, the photos from uh, f um, Photoshop to InDesign. And um, you would have the entire document in InDesign and uh, you will export it um, directly from there. Now, this was just one example and obviously there are um, situations in which you can use one and the other. Um, I mean, you, you could potentially do also um, things like business cards in uh, InDesign or you could also do them in uh, Illustrator, for example. Um, there's many flows that you can follow, but as a rule of thumb, um, I would say that InDesign is great when uh, it comes to um, the, uh, the general flow of certain type of projects, um, such as magazines, brochures, uh, ebooks uh, and uh, stuff like that. So yeah, hope this was uh, clear. Uh, during this course, we're going to do some live examples. So these concepts will become easier um, as you follow the course.